Happy Monday, Castle family. This is Amanda and Katrina here with your Castle communication. First of all, some updates. Um, a lot of you have asked about the flood restoration. We don't have an end date for the repairs, but we've been told once the blowers are turned off, that means everything's dry and it'll take about two weeks after that to get flooring installed. Extended day starts today. Thank you to everybody for their hard work getting it ready to go. We have 400 students enrolled and nine teachers who are teaching various electives. The extended day program is going to run for five weeks. Signups for second quarter will be sent out on October 16th and the second quarter extended day will start October 30th. We're looking forward to seeing these kiddos' faces after school and hope it's gonna be a great experience for all. All right, and then thank you so much for getting those classroom furniture orders to me. Amanda and I have put those in with our furniture company and we will let you know approximate delivery dates once we get a purchase order in. Over the weekend, Melvin spent time painting numbers on the blacktop, so we all have official places to line up. This will be very helpful coming to and from the Inspire Lab rotations and then just to help keep the kiddos organized in the morning. And then it's time to start doing nominations for school site council. By the end of today, you should have letters to parents. We need several parent nominees. So give that form out to your student students and have them return them by Thursday with possible parent nominees interested in school site council. We will also need a few teacher volunteers for school site council. Those forms will be in your box tomorrow. It is evaluation season, so all new staff members will need to sign up for evaluations. If you are a second year teacher, you will need to sign up for evaluations. And then if you're lucky enough to have a last name that starts with the letters M through Z, you will also need to sign up for an evaluation. We will have dates and times posted on the door by the end of the week so that you can start signing up. All right, and then some reminders. As you guys know, collaboration begins this week. Please follow the procedures outlined in last week's staff meeting. We sent a blue handout out. If you need that again, let us know. Uh, you will have PLC time this Wednesday. Uh, a portion of that time uh, the lead teachers will use to give you an introduction to our new Illuminate program. And then Ivan Alba is coming back out next week for Math Professional Development. That's the week of the 25th. Natalie will put subs in. We should have schedules in your boxes by end of the day tomorrow. And just a friendly reminder, if you're coming into the building, please remember to not walk through classrooms, especially since our Inspire Lab rotations have started. And then September is National Attendance Awareness Month. Please encourage your students to attend. I've seen several classrooms recognize when the class had perfect attendance. So just kind of keep that in mind and encourage kids to be here for school. And note for third through sixth grade teachers, you have a new recess and lunch schedule that started today. Uh, Katrina and I uh, enjoyed hearing your feedback and hope that uh, the tweak in the schedule works better for the teachers. And then Ms. Hilton is here this week and she is working on a new after school yard duty schedule based on the results from the Google form that went out last week. So stay tuned for a revised schedule. All right, our shout outs for Shannon Hilton is here at Castle this week. So we're very excited to have her back. And then Melvin did a great job painting our new lines, our new numbers out on the blacktop and he came in this weekend to do that. So thank you, Melvin. And then Ms. Baker Horak, Ms. Lockridge, Neil, Ryland Dietz, Angulo, Hoover, Dignan, Sniffen, and Samari and De Leon offered up their classrooms for Misty and Emiliano so that they can uh, participate in the Inspire Lab rotation. And then um, shout out to Brie and Jill. They worked so hard last week organizing Extended Day and making sure we had the name tags for our specials rotation. So thanks, Brie and Jill. Emiliano has been spending his Saturdays going to an art workshop at UCLA. And then Jen Dignan has started Battle of the Books. Thank you, Jen. And Ashley Brown has started Oral Language. Thank you, Ashley. 
And then Misty got us a donation of recycling bins that can be used in the classrooms. Thank you so much, Misty. And then Kim and Jackie and Char have been working hard developing a check-in, check-out system that has really improved one of our second grade students' behavior. So thank you very much to you. All right, Castle family, that's the end of this week's Castle Communication. Thank you for listening.